What's happening everyone, my name is Alex and welcome back. Well in today's video I'm going to show you some super cool things that you can do with the Samsung Galaxy S10 and this small OTG connector that comes in the box with it. If you don't know what um, OTG means, well that means on the go because you can do things on the go on your smartphone and you don't need a computer for them. What I'm about to show you also works on most Android devices, so not only on the S10. And if your phone didn't come with one of these in the box, you can buy one for three to four dollars. So they're very inexpensive. And if I come um, across any cheap ones, I'm gonna try to leave some links in the video's description. The first thing I wanna show you is printing directly from your smartphone without needing a computer anymore. So most printers have a USB cable that gets plugged in um, in the back of your computer. Well, if you take the same cable and you plug it in um, in your phone, you don't need a computer anymore. Depending on the printer that um, you're using, you're gonna have to install a plugin on your smartphone, but you can find most plugins um, in the Google Play Store. And in my case, I had to install the HP plugin because I have an HP printer. But once I do that, I can basically print anything. So websites, papers that I'm writing and so on. So very, very simple to do so. And uh, this kind of replaces your computer, at least the need um, to use the computer for printing. The next thing I wanna show you is an endoscope camera. So this is basically a very small camera that has um, some small LED these at the front here and this has a super long cable. You connect the back of the cable, so the end of the cable to your smartphone through that um, OTG connector and then you open an app and you can see everything that this camera sees. And this could be useful for a lot, a lot of things. You can put these under doors, you can put these in vents, you can put these in pipes and so on. So it really depends what, um, what you're working, but um, this could be useful in construction and stuff like that. So yet another cool thing that um, you can do through that um, OTG connector. Moving on to another super useful thing and something that a lot of people may know, you can basically connect a computer keyboard uh, to your smartphone through that OTG connector. So you just plug it in and then you can use that um, keyboard to type emails, to type messages or anything like that. So if you're writing a long email or if you're writing a paper for school, having a real keyboard could be very, very useful. You can also plug in a mouse or so a regular computer mouse. But again, you're gonna have to unplug that keyboard. But if you have um, a USB hub, then you can just plug in that USB hub and then you can connect the keyboard and the mouse at the same time. So your phone basically becomes a computer. You can also power or charge a bunch of things through this. So for example, if you have a smartwatch, you can plug in the smartwatch in your smartphone and then you can charge the smartwatch right from your smartphone and that could be useful in a million situations. The same goes for some headphones. You can plug in some headphones and charge some headphones. As for powering devices, well, if you have like a USB fan, you can power that USB fan from, um, from your phone or if you have like a USB flashlight, you can also power that from um, your phone. So very, very cool things to do with this and I'm sure that there are way more things to power um, from your phone. You can also plug in a USB card reader in your little connector there. So let's say that you have a DSLR camera, you film something and you have um, everything filmed on a SD card. Well, you can take that SD card, plug it in that card reader, plug that card reader um, in your phone and then you can see everything that you have on that card reader. You can save stuff on your phone or you can even delete um, and move stuff from um, the SD card. The same goes for USB sticks. So you can plug in a regular USB stick. If you have any movies on it or any data that you need to save, you can just use um, your phone's file explorer and copy and um, delete stuff from the USB stick. And um, you can also use an external hard drive, but it really depends what kind of an external hard drive because some need more power than um, the phone can, um, can give them. So some, some work, some don't, but once again, you can use that file explorer to copy files, delete files, or even watch movies if you have movies on, on an external drive. So yeah, there are a lot of things that you can do with one of these um, and an Android device, mostly with the S10 because I have the S10 um, right here. Uh, for example, you can even plug in a USB microphone and this way you can record better sound uh, from your smartphone because you're going through a real microphone, not the phone's microphone and uh, a lot of other um, things that you could possibly do, but you just have to think of, um, of them. Alright guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did like it, press that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.